These are members of Nigerian Labour Congress and Trade Union Congress in Ubu State Chapter who have joined their counterparts in the nationwide protest against hardship and high cost of living in Nigeria. They marched through major roads to government house to press home their demands which include approval of new minimum wage, improved welfare packages, palliative to caution the effect of subsidy removal, among others. Temple heightened when the Secretary of the State Government came to address them, but they insisted on having the governor present. After a while, they were allowed into the premises where they were received by the Deputy Governor, Ifain Osan. We are tired of what is happening in the country. 30,000 Naira ca cannot feed the tank of Ikeke, not to tank of uh, uh, any Toyota or Pijo, any car. And somebody receives that as a monthly salary. From there you pay rent. From there you go to hospital. From there you pay school fees. From there you feed your children. From there you go to meet no more now. We said no. When they pressed, we said, all right, if you want to remove subsidy, repair refineries so that we will not depend on exchange rates. The government agreed to all that, but never did any, only to announce the removal of subsidy on the 29th of May. As the governor was not on seat, the deputy governor, Ifai Osai, appreciated the peaceful nature of the protests and reassured government's unalloyed commitment to welfare of workers in the state. By the time we come to fruition with the plans we have for Enugu State in the medium to long term, the salaries you earn will go a long way in making life a lot easier because those constructive challenges that take away that resource, government will have taken care of them. So I want to thank you for your contribution to Enugu State. And I want to pledge that the message you've given us to deliver to the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, that that message you get to Abuja. The hope is that governments will expedite action to safeguard Nigerians from untold hardship. Naomi Jonathan, Hero TV News, Enugu.